Welcome to the mailbag on the Dean Show. I'm Yusuf Festus, and for the next few minutes, we'd like to talk about some of the mail that we receive here on a regular basis. Some of the letters that we receive from you are very stimulating and cause us to reflect and go back to the sources of Islam so that we're able to determine exactly what the answer to these questions are. I received one today that is actually representative of a lot of the emails that we get talking about Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and his marriage to his wife Aisha. They're concerned often in these uh, uh, letters and emails to us about the age of Aisha, and they're asking us, for instance, in this case, we'd like to know, is it true that the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, married his wife Aisha when she was a child? And if so, what does this mean, and how do we understand that about child brides in Islam? The questioner goes on, but it seems to continue in this same way. What we want to begin with is to tell you that Islam is always about rights and limits. But now, about divorce, we do have another chapter for that, but what we're going to focus on now is about this issue of age of Aisha. So, in chapter 4, the women, the one I'm talking about, you go to verse number 19, and it says, O you who believe, you cannot inherit women against their will. Meaning that... This is very clear. A man could not marry a girl. He could only marry a woman. A woman meaning that she's old enough to have children and old enough and mature enough in her mind to make the, these kinds of decisions. <clears throat> Tabati. The Prophet married Asia in Mecca three years before the Hijra, after the death of Khadija. At the time, she was six. Ishak. When the Apostle came to Medina, he was 53. Tabari. In May 623 A.D., or A.H. 1, Allah's Messenger consummated his marriage to Asia. Now let us turn to the subject at hand. We're talking about the age now of Aisha. Only Aisha herself is telling us about this. She is telling us, for in her own words, what her age was when her mother came to her and she was playing outside playing outside in the dirt with her toys or whatever, her mother comes to her and says, come in the house. She was six years old. Mother takes her into the house to see her father. Her father is there offering her hand in marriage now to Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. offering the hand of his daughter to the prophet who is his best friend and this was a custom a tradition in their society so it was definitely well within the uh, limits of the society they lived in it was approved totally but look at this it wasn't accepted by muhammad how do we know how do we know well because if you keep reading you'll see that she went back outside and continued playing body. My mother came to me while I was being swung on a swing between two branches and got me down. My nurse took over and wiped my face with some water and started leading me. When I was at the door, she stopped so I could catch my breath. I was brought in while Muhammad was sitting on a bed in our house. My mother made me sit on his lap. The other men and women got up and left. The prophet consummated his marriage with me in my house when I was nine years old. <laughs> 